Hey everybody, uh, just going to do a quick upgrade to the RV today. Uh, last time we went camping, we went to Ashford's Lake and it uh, was kind of muddy there. So when we finally got parked, set up, leveled out and everything, uh, mud was just caked uh, right here on our step sidewall, uh, which, you know, it came loose once we set up the step, but uh, I didn't really like it because we used this door uh, for our main entrance. Uh, we do have a master bedroom door. Um, but we don't necessarily use that one all that often. So this is the one that we use the most So we didn't like the fact that mud just uh, came and got caked up in here and got on our steps and everything so uh, Looked on Amazon found these uh, mud flaps there. Uh, so we're going to install these today. Luckily for us We have a, a Lance trailer. It's a 2285 model uh, And we have these brackets uh, that are for the the body and that attach to the frame and they already have some holes in it that we're going to use, and we just got to drill one more. Um, so it's going to make the install pretty easy for us. Obviously, with your trailer, it's going to be something different, and somebody might have to do something different if you wanted to do this. But uh, you might not have this problem anyway. But uh, we're just going to do this quick upgrade, uh, drill one hole. I've already stepped up uh, the bit a couple times uh, to the size of 3 8 That's the last hole we're going to drill. Um, so we're going to drill this and install it, and uh, it's going to be pretty easy. We'll have to mark out the holes in these mud flaps once we position them, once I get the hole drilled. But uh, we'll mark those holes, drill the holes, install it, and uh, be done. And uh, never have to have mud on our steps again. So stay tuned. Okay, so uh, as I said, I've got uh, already stepped up the drill bit twice. Uh, so now we got the 3 8 drill bit on there. Gonna finish drilling the last hole and size up the mud flaps, mark the holes, drill the holes in the mud flaps, and bolt them on. So here we go. Okay, so got the holes drilled. Now we're just gonna mark them out uh, through the holes here once we uh, size it up and we'll drill the holes in the mud flaps and bolt it up. Okay, so you can see here we've got our holes marked. Um, I'll probably need to mark this one over again. Um, you can see here that these are the spots that they originally put in the mud flaps for someone to use, but obviously that's not going to work for our application, so we're going to do something different. Okay, we got our holes drilled, now we'll bolt it up. I got uh, three eighths bolts here, uh, six of them, three for this side, three for the other side. I'm going to use a washer in the front, another washer to support it, and a lock washer so it doesn't uh, back off from, you know, loosening up. Okay, we'll tighten these down and there you have it, pretty easy.